We're on a journey to all energy. And first stop is Glenn Morris's place at Hillsville. Riding shotgun with me is the Jerry V4. In the back, I've got the Jerry solar panel. I've also got the Jerry V6 and the Jerry V10. It's gonna be an amazing journey to all energy, but the journey beyond the Jerry, I think for the people of the planet with portable power, and we wanna power your freedom, the Jerry is gonna be the most exciting thing I've ever done. Jerry V4, PD100 and AC. Now the PD100s on the MacBook Pro, we're running at around 34 watts as it charges it out. But it's also running the Lenovo laptop. Now I've been charging up with a bit of coffee as I head up to Glen Morris's in about 20 minutes. But essentially you want to know more about the Jerry range, keep watching, keep following, keep liking, keep tagging as we tag and we unpack what the Jerry's can do to help you power your freedom. So why could the V4 be the hero of the Jerry offering? Just over four kilos, the, the V4 at 403 watt hours is just an incredible little product. It allows the portability because of its weight, yet you've got a ton of power there at 403 watt hours. You've got hours of outdoor work or outdoor living or person studying and you, you want to cram, you don't want to be locked up inside. You want to be free in an environment like currently driving through, as I am here, a rainforest. You know, pull up, do some work, plug in the solar panel, spend a couple of days here. On your charge in, you've got your DC in from your AC-DC converter plug going straight in. And then you've got your PD100 in. So you can put it around 170 watts to charge this. These things have got a light on there, a flashlight, and then it's got an emergency flash. It's great for the family. I think it'd be great for my parents in their retired years, as they are now. And if they want you know, a little bit of backup power at home for a blackout, that's not gonna be heavy for them to take out of their, um, let's say, linen press, or wherever they decide to store the little unit, because it's such a compact little unit could slide anywhere, you know, from under a bed to in the garden shed. What does the Jerry range weigh? If you look at the V, try and just calculate that in a kilo. So around four kilos for the V4. V6 is gonna be around six kilos. The V10, around 10 kilos. One other thing that we've got to offer the market is the Jerry PV setup. Four panels uh, in the one fold out. It's really easy peasy to set up. Look at this, PV everywhere, Glenn Morris's. Hope you're enjoying the journey to all energy. Matt Jai and obviously with Mr. Glenn Morris, you'll be at all energy, Glenn, won't you? Uh, I'll be there. Come and check me out at the Solar Plus booth. Just done the podcast with Glenn and I'm camped up for the night and it's an exciting journey. You're out and about, you want to top up your portable power station with a bit of natural energy. Well, let's just plug in the PV to do so. Jerry V6, plugged into the Jerry solar panel. Panels are set up facing due west, capturing the afternoon sun. I can rotate these panels and move them super simply by literally lifting it up. There's little back supports at the back here of the PV. So the portable panel is just set here in the grass facing due west as the sun's setting. The Jerry V6, what is it capturing at the moment? That's capturing 57 watts of energy. So that's a beautiful way to top up my Jerry V6 as the day concludes here. And just a wonderful way to power your freedom. How you do it? <laughs> Snakes and all.
I got two phones plugged into the B6, one into the USB-C and the other into the USB-A. And I'm currently drawing nine watts of power in the V6. So 622 watt hours of lithium power at our portable power station and nine watts is coming out, which is really, really efficient for two phones. Firing shotgun today is the Jerry V6. 622 watt hours for portable power station. Two AC outs, you've got your three USB A's, your one USB C, you've got your PD100 for your in and out, you've got your DC in, your DC on this is the same as the V4, it's a smaller DC in as far as your charger, so it's 120 watts. Your charger will allow about 90 in. And then you, if you want to get your greatest charge, go USB-C in as well at the same time. Oh, I could just stay right here. Yeah, ideally at some point soon I'll be pulling up and busting out one of the Jerry's and powering it up and getting a lappy or two into it because I've got a call with Charmin coming up at the head office. We've got a, a new lady who wants to join the Jerry journey. So I might bust out the, probably the V10 for that. I think it's important, we need to have... I've got around three hours of drive time to destination next, which is the 12 Apostles, which I believe is about nine now. So you're on the road and you're with the family and you've got everything including the bikes in the back of your camper. One of the uh, greatest things to have is that energy security with you. 1,036 watt hours, three AC outs. You've got your 2.4 volt standard USB A's, five amp, three of them at the front. You get everything you want on there. The USB-C, that is an always on in and out function. You've got yourself a fridge or an appliance that needs permanent power. Best thing to do is get a USB-C to 12 volt car adapter. Similar to this, used to be called the old cigarette lighter, the female end of it, put it into your fridge, power it up all day, and you got that energy security you need for your cold goods. So there it is, the Jerry V10. If you want to get it in your hands or any other portable power stations or accessories we have on offer, certainly contact us or one of our distributors so you can be powering your freedom.